today's video we're going to be taking the mustang interior apart and uh doing a little bit of paint design to it hopefully it comes out good if not we'll just uh sand it down and paint it black but well, i'm gonna take this bezel out or whatever you would call it this uh that goes over the speedometer and stuff i'm gonna take this radio thing out and the shifter thing out uh i already took the bolts out of here there's some weird uh thing it says 220 by 4. so then this from what i see you take you put something in there and it should pull off i may have to do this off camera to learn how to do it because i've never done it before and i don't want to break it So I'll get that one off camera, but over here we gotta take the shifter off. Pull this bad boy off. Got somebody out there, evil Knievel in it. The background, if you can hear that. Got to be, hey, what are you doing, man? Slow down, slow down. I swear the shifter has like a million and one threads on it. Morgan's behind the camera. You can say hello, Morgan. Mm. She's gonna go, mmm. <laughs> Alright, we almost there. We almost there. Okay, shifter's off. So then this thing just pops out somehow. Watch I break this. Oh, just like that. Alright, and that pops out. I'm going to take that boot off somehow or something, or tape it up. Uh, I'll probably tape it up, it looks like they glued it back on. I don't know what they did there. But we figured out, because this is what we're going to be painting, so. All this silver. I may try to tape this black off. Don't know yet. And then this, I got to pop out somehow, but I don't know if it's in my screws. So I'll get this out and that out, and then get back to you guys. Not we got Morgan over here. She said not to film her, but we're still going to film her. She's okay. Don't worry about her. Don't take don't take that offensive like that. I shouldn't be making this video right now. She's just messing around, <laughs> but she, she's trying to tape that off, and then we're gonna try to tape the shifter boot off because they I glued it on, and I don't feel like messing with all that today. So I'm just gonna try to tape that off. But I took the cigarette uh, thing out, and that thing nothing really has to be taped off on it. They already painted that, so we'll just paint back over it. Uh. And where I took everything off that, even the vents out. But there's two little vents I don't want to mess with taking them out. Like the things that control the vent. Because I don't want to break them. I started to and it seemed like they were going to crack. So just tape them off. And then we'll get started with spraying. I'll show you guys what we're going to do to it. So now that Morgan somewhat got those taped up. We didn't have the right tape. So if we get paint on there, don't judge her too much. <laughs> but I'm just wiping them down with rub and alcohol. I already did the other pieces. Just try to get like the grease and stuff off them so the paint somewhat comes out better. It's just spray paint. This is some lighter kind of stuff right now. But it should turn out good. If anything, these, I'm sure I can find these plastic pieces. Like out of junk or something and just put black ones back in there. But, now we take this over here now. I already got the other one set over here. that like that and we got this red and we got this blue that we're going to be doing right now and then we're going to put i gotta get the dawn soap but after that dries somewhat with the red and blue we're going to put dawn soap on it in like a design kind of thing and then we're going to take this black paint and paint all over it let this dry a good bit and then rinse the dawn soap off i'm sure you guys seen it done to other stuff but i'll start with the blue and then i'll show you guys what it looks like before we put the uh on soap and stuff on it. So we got the pieces painted with the red and blue. I've been shaking the black a lot, so now I'm going to hook up the hose, get this ready to go. Guys, we're gonna need this for this part. Get this all ready to go. Should I put it on jet, Morgan, or should I put it on rinse first? I'm just put it on shower. Shower. Okay, so <coughs> we turn that on. Get 
some water going. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is I'm gonna actually have Morgan do this part because I'm not really good at uh, doing stuff where she's gonna make like a design kind of with the Dawn soap. Then I'm gonna go over and paint it with the black. So I'll take the camera real fast, show you uh, her doing that a little bit. And then after she gets all that done, I'm just gonna paint them over with the black and then we'll rinse it off. Uh, get a clip of us rinsing it off so you guys can see what it's gonna look like. We got them all painted black now. You can see, gotta let that dry a little bit and then we're gonna rinse it off. Uh, yeah, I hope it comes out good. It looks like it might, but if it doesn't, we'll just get new pieces. So maybe experiment with these more after we get new pieces if these don't come out good. But we'll I get them rinsed off and then we'll start putting them back in the car, hopefully. Alright guys, so now we're going to get them in the car. I'm going to start with uh, this one first and then I'll get the rest of them and show you guys what the finished product looks like after it's in the car. Product, whatever, we're putting the plastic pieces back in the car. But uh, this is what they came out with. They got a weird feeling to them. But I don't mind them. I'm just hoping they look good and I hope I like it for a long time. If not, we'll just change it up or get new ones. But yeah, let's go get this one in the car. Morgan, follow me right over this way. Morgan can have the camera again. So if it's shaking, uh, I'll give you guys an Instagram if you can yell at her. If anyone watches this. Just kidding. Yep, we're just gonna slide this one in there. They're still a little wet, so I'm trying not to like, touch, touch them. But I'm, I'm patient and I want to see what it looks like. But yeah, okay, so I'll slide this in there, get everything hooked up, and we'll go from there. Morgan just got a finger stuck in the <laughs> shifter knob. Uh, she's tightening that, she's gonna throw that on. This is what it looks like. I think it looks decent. If you guys like it, let me know. If you don't, well then, let me know why you don't like it. And yeah, I don't know what to say if you don't like it. I did break that, uh, so I'll be looking for a new vent. And I kind of wish I would have taped this off right through here because now it doesn't match that. But you know, it's okay. Uh, my mom's out here. She don't want to be on camera, but maybe we can get her opinion on camera. Mom, come look at it. I want your opinion on this. How's this look? Bad or good? I don't care if you say bad, if you don't like it, or do you like it? I like it. Alright, she likes it, so I got approval. I think I'm going to put a red light in there, instead of being green. And I'm going to put a blue light up here. So, look out for that. Uh, I may put the blue light in tomorrow, so that'll be in this video, but... I think this, this came out pretty good. This is a nice little paint lacy mod that I did, so... Yeah. Alright guys, so uh, the lights for the interior is going to take like a month to get in because uh, I ordered them offline. I can't find them at the store. Uh, I may be dumb, but so I'm going to end this video, but I'll talk a little bit. I was going to make a video of painting the trunk blue, but it didn't turn out good enough. The video didn't. The trunk's turned out okay, so I'm going to put that back together. I'll show you in one of the videos what I did, but I got uh, a front visor thing uh, where the windshield wipers goes for the Mustang, so it would be make a video of that here soon and the Civic I got an intake in I'll show you the intake so we'll be putting that back together soon here it is it's a cheap one it was like a hundred bucks but uh, I wouldn't recommend buying one there's a lot of like stuff along with it that I could see already even though it's new and stuff it's just so cheap like uh if you blow in it a bunch of little metal shavings just fly out of it so that could probably get sucked into the engine uh cause some problems so if you do get one make sure you clean it up real good try to blow out with an air compressor through like all the holes uh but yeah if you like the uh, videos please like comment subscribe see ya